Hello everybody, we're back with more ghosts, with subtitles this time. I blame Python. I, I, I don't blame Python, I blame Call of Duty Ghosts for being a broken mess. Uh, what is the first thing you check whenever you LP something? Is there subtitles? Yes. Are they on? Probably not. 100% I thought they would be on because Call of Duty, like, Modern Warfare and Modern Warfare 2 and Modern Warfare 3 all have them on by default. Mm, so. Little did everyone know that space was, the satellite thing was literally firing. Um... Pull out two dust. <laughs> Undo everything. Why is the city on, on fire and like... It just doesn't make sense to me. This this game. This game. So yeah, Ten it's, uh, years later. Welcome back to Call of Duty Ghosts, Python, Fox, you know, as always. But uh, yeah, uh, yeah, it's been ten years. Probably been, been ten, ten years, years since, since the last, last update. update. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We're sinking jokes. We Fantastic. will become one mind. <laughs> See what this has done to us? We have fused into one body, one mind. We have the dog fused mind. into yeah, dog body. Uh, it just keeps happening. Anyway, uh, yeah. Ten years after that whole space laser blow up America thing. I guess. Now we get an actual weapon, and we're not in space anymore. Hooray! Space guns. Also, thank you to the guy for correcting me about space. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was I was absolutely not expecting an effort post literally one update after, uh, like, into the thread. So that was pretty uh, surprising and fantastic and awesome. Thank you very much. See, I'm chalking up the fact that that was my impression of what would happen in space because that's what every single movie does that has yeah. space sections. We'll see, I've I don't seen, watch that many movies, so... I've seen far too many people sucked out of bullet holes in a space station. I think it's also been in a couple of video games as well. I, rem I remember one movie about space that I watched. It was... I didn't know it back then, but it was incredibly incorrect. And so, thinking about it now, it just seems like a bunch of stupid bullshit. I can't remember the name of the movie, but it's like, someone got sucked out in space and blew up. Because of decompression or something. That I, sounds like, uh, God, what is it, that Arnold Schwarzenegger movie? No, I don't think, no. He wasn't in it, I'm sure of that. But anyway, this, this is no longer space ghosts. Space Ghosts. Space Ghost, Coast to Coast. <laughs> nope, now we're chasing deer. But, uh, with guns. W well, what else do you chase deer with? Bow and arrow. Crossbow. Boy, I'm glad you went in a different direction than my mind was going. One. I, I, I don't really want to... I'm not at liberty to say. Shoot it up the ass with a crossbow deal with I'm <laughs> I'll go on but, record and say I do not like hunting one little bit. <laughs> anyway, uh, to get at least a little bit on track, yeah, we're in uh, what appears to be San Diego, California. I, or, nope, wait, nope, there's the a Hollywood sign. There's the Hollywood sign, I'm completely wrong. Mm. Good to see the attacks didn't affect this area. Well, Looks exactly of. the same. <laughs> <laughs> I see what you did there. Mm-hmm. No, you didn't uh, at first. No, oh, God, I didn't. No. Also, oh, God, no. also, despite Snap 2, I'm still incredibly bad at aiming on consoles. Which has been proven incorrect that I'm not any better on PC due to the recent release of Titanfall, which you should all buy and play immediately. Yes, support Respawn Entertainment. It, it's actually shown that um, two guys that develop Modern Warfare... Uh, Zampella? Yeah, Zampella and West. Yeah, Zampella and West actually do have talent. Oh my god, do they ever. And it makes you wonder, how much of Modern Warfare 2 did they have control over? 
and how much of Modern Warfare 2 did Activision have control over. Mm. <sighs> we'll never know. All we can say is that Modern Warfare 2 probably shouldn't have existed. Yeah, Modern Warfare was only going to be standalone, according to someone in the thread, who I don't know the name of. I apologize for that. <laughs> All right. Who needs fact checking and anything else? We're 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 playing Modern Warfare Four, essentially. We're playing generic brown gun game <laughs> with dog. Oh, sorry. There's there's green. Look look. There's green sign. Green colors. There you go. Colorful Ooh. game. Oh colors. How I've missed oh, the. so much bloom. It's like playing Oblivion. <laughs> so this is actually what I consider to be the first actual firefight of the game. It's, uh... As such, it's not particularly difficult to your, you know, generic kind of sit behind cover and plink away at enemies above you kind of thing. I will say one thing, at least... <clears throat> at least Infinity Ward have, like, held themselves back from just going, hey, it's ten years in the future. Giant robots and guns that shoot you know, cannon bullets and stuff like that. Like, you know, basically yeah. being like serious Sam. Laser guns! Yeah, because they, they stuck to yeah. mundane weaponry. I mean, it is boring, but at the same time, this is probably what guns will be like 10 years in the future. They won't change at all. Right. Yeah, like, no, why, uh, why fix something that's not broken? Because eventually someone somewhere will break it. I mean, the development I can see guns going in 10 years is that they will be attached to robots and therefore humans won't actually have to use them and be in danger. Which will make war kind of moot. If Do you, you see that it. tire? That tire is terribly textured. <laughs> and I Let remind you, you, I remind you all that this is being played on a bone, okay? Let me tell you, that hubcap is so rusted, it's rusted the tire as well. <laughs> Somehow it's turned that rubber into metal and it's just rusted it completely. The future of video games, ladies and gentlemen. The future of video games. That, that was a rich person's car and their wheel was just gold-plated. Mm, okay. It, or, I suppose, gold doesn't. Because gold, gold doesn't rust. Well, I... it does, but it's like green rust, like brass, I think. Someone I... correct me in the thread, because inevitably I know it's going to happen. <laughs> but... <laughs> I'm just going to let you say all the dumb shit. Okay. Just just letting you know now. <laughs> I'm not going to go go on a limb at any point during this LP, besides the fact that I called Hollywood San Diego. It's alright, it's like, you know... It's, it's like Modern Warfare 2, where I couldn't actually tell you what mon monument we were looking at. Despite living literally monument? half an hour away. What is it the money man Jersey? <laughs> I'm not sure that's a thing. Hey Ma, get over here! They're building a a monument in Jersey. That's my best Jersey impression. It was fantastic, let me tell you. Spot on, really. <laughs> I actually am living in Jersey as of this moment, <laughs> and I have developed a Jersey accent in like a week. What can I say? Yeah. So here we're introduced to, I guess, the one liberty they took with the futuristic weapons. Act actually, before before I let you stick your foot in your mouth again, this actually exists in some form. Oh really, does it? Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's a guide by wire rocket. But it, is this it does like... Is this like Black Ops 2 or Black Ops or Black Ops 2 where they had the the remote controlled helicopter that has guns on it that the military has never used but they put in the game because hey they might use it someday. I, I don't know. I'm pretty sure like guide by wire missiles are actually used in the military, so But yeah, uh, at first I thought, you know, hey, Half Life Two callback, rip off, whatever you want to call it, but no, it actually does exist, so. I'm going to say it's a rip off, because I'm guessing someone in the military played Half-Life 2 and saw that guy, <laughs> uh, laser guided rocket, and was like, we should get to work on developing that, and then that's how that came to exist. 
Mm. It's not a crazy notion. I mean, video games have influenced things in the past. 20 minutes later, we're still talking about this. It's Santa Monica. Look at this dog. That dog is a boss. He's the dog boss. With expert dog AI. Mm. Not as good as the fish AI, but... No, of course not. They spent years working on that fish AI, alright? And we haven't even seen it yet. You'll, your mind Perfect. will be blown, I assure you. Perfect fish bloops. <laughs> Randomly generated fish bloops. Of course. Yeah. It's like Cod the Roguelike. <laughs> but with fish. Yeah, that's an interesting... That's an interesting thought. <laughs> Make uh, like a first. Well, that'd be Borderlands. Never mind. It's not so interesting anymore. <laughs> still, still interesting, but not not as much as I thought, because it's already been made. So anyway, back on topic of COD. <laughs> Why would we ever want to be back on topic with this game? There are so many more. There's so much to make fun of. Hoping to find a way into the city. So I will ruin the magic here. I have seen this before, mm. because we tried to record it via a stream, but it uh, didn't go so well. <laughs> so, there's a story. Yeah, we uh, we tried doing this live, and uh, A, Twitch lag is just terrible right now, and B, the Xbox One apparently decided to stop by putting video to my uh, capture card, so... Mm -hmm. Yeah. So we're going to No Man's Land, which is the same place as the Elephant Graveyard. Which means we get a song and dance. It's the same place where the cell P exists. <laughs> we're going to get a song and dance without being prepared. Somewhere you know better than anyone. You're going home. Ah, I've missed home. You're going home, son. He cries as he. Like lets him go in the water and he slowly drifts away. 